I'm here to make a pickup for Rise. Back already? We just paid off you bloodsuckers. Don't shoot the messenger. I'm just trying to get by like everybody else. Yeah? So are we. Rise said he'd protect us if we paid him. But so far, all he's done is take our money. There's no protection, just threats. You any different? Look, all I want to do is get this over with. What's it gonna take, huh? Don't need to point out how easy it would be to set this entire place on fire. Jesus Christ. You people are fucking monsters. All my money's in that satchel. Take it and get the fuck out. Hey, for what it's worth, this isn't something I want to do. I'd rather be helping you guys. And yet you're still doing it, aren't you? Okay, Kareem. I made the collection at the ferry station. And I'm pretty sure I'm going... What's wrong? Someone's turned on the 18th floor. We're doing our best to contain the situation, but... We can't sugarcoat this train. We need Anderson right fucking now! Rise has promised me two crates, Brecken. Two crates. I'm doing this shit as fast as I can, I swear. Just... God, just hurry, please! Way back, I guess. Good. I need you to make a quick detour. Not. Why? One of our patrols went off the grid somewhere near the market. How is that my problem? I'm making it your problem. See if you can find them, or don't bother coming back.
Kareem, I think I found your lost patrol. Something ripped them limb from limb. Search the bodies. Look for some blueprints in a small envelope. Did you find the envelope? Not yet. Wait a sec. Okay, I got it. Good. Bring it back to me right away. You're going to be a hero around here. your help finding my son Christoph. You work for Rise, don't you? Sure, for protection. But I can't go to him for a thing like this. My son is... he's young. He thinks with his mouth instead of his head. He doesn't understand that sometimes you've got to go along with people who aren't so good. Now he's run off to join Brecken's bunch at the tower. He thinks he's going to be a runner. That's not the safest line of work. He's going to get himself killed. He's not ready. He's too young to be out there. Shouldn't you be looking for him yourself? You don't understand. I make weapons for eyes. If the new ones aren't ready when his people come, me and Kristoff are both dead. Please, do this for me. I'll give you something good. Something special. Okay? Yeah, maybe I'll ask around at the tower. If I find something, I'll let you know. But if you ask me, your protection seems to have you pretty scared. You should really think about it. So, I think it's safe to say that Rice isn't the most popular person in town, huh? No, but he is the most feared. And you know the old saying, it is better to be feared than loved if one cannot be both. Ah, uh, Machiavelli. Correct. Smart fellow, that one. Blueprints. Excellent. You're a lot more dependable than most of these drunks. Rise is waiting for you. Maybe we can work together again sometime. God, I hope not. If you show them compassion, they will see it as weakness. Even I you will keep your whole on. Understand? I give you shelter, I give you bread, women, bullets, and you cannot do a simple task. I should send every one of you to the pit. Ah, the tower lackey returns. Do you have something for me, friend? 
Yes, I do. Now it's time for you to give me what you promised. Two crates of Andesin. I think not. Your loyalty to the tower is nothing but blind obedience, Crane. A coward's submission to false hierarchies. You follow their rules as thoughtlessly as you follow mine. Like a good little dog. Look, we had a deal. Your people need the antasy. Now, more than ever, I would surmise. But a man who follows someone else's rules is no man at all. Here, I will allow you this much. You promised me two crates of it. This is only five vials. If you want more, I present you with an opportunity. The athlete, the Scorpion, Jade Aldemir. She's one of your number. Bring her to me. I have an arena where men fight for our amusement. I would have this Scorpion fight for us. I'm curious how long it will take for someone of her caliber to uh, break. What? No. No, forget it. I'm not doing it. I hear no true conviction in your voice, Crane. You have not yet made your choice, I can tell. Will you be a dog and save the dwellers of the tower? Or will you be a man and save the maiden? Go and think about it. Come and see me when you get back. I've got something for you. Ah, shit. Crane here. Report. Look, I'm no longer cooperating with Rise. He wanted me to kidnap Jade Aldemir and dump her with him so he can make her fight in his pit. Yes, and? Was that it? What do you mean, was that it? I'm not a fucking human trafficker. You seem to have forgotten how much is riding on this file, Crane. If Rise wants one girl, then give her to him. You'll be there to keep an eye on her, won't you? What the... What the fuck kind of humanitarian outfit are you guys? And for that matter, if this project file can save the world, why keep it a fucking secret? We're not paying you to be insubordinate, Crane. Get this done. Fuck you, asshole. Any guess what happened? None. And our gas man Jeff open quit on us last week. He was kind of irreplaceable. Maybe I can track him down. Make maybe definitely and get on it fast. Word is he's built up his own little fortress somewhere behind the train station. This is the Fort Jefferson Tower, and you will address me as Commander Jeff. I make the rules here, is that clear? Not Brecken, not Rice, 
This is Jeffville, or Jeff Land, or Jeffertown, New Jeff City. Look, Jeff. Commander Jeff! There's an emergency. The gas is out all over the city. Oh, yeah. That... that was me. But you shut off the gas? Installation of the Fort Jefferson Apocalypse Wall required a temporary interruption of the civilian gas supply. But I'm all ready now, so you can turn it back on. I think that's going to be your job. No can do. I'm too critical to base operations. I have to send someone who's expendable. <clears throat> Commander, I'd like to volunteer. You're a good man, whoever you said you are. I hate to lose you. Now, go open the quadrant allocation valves, plus the primary distribution gate. Then report back to me, and I'll restore the city main pressure here. Hey! If you don't get killed, you can be the first civilian to witness my apocalypse wall. Thank <laughs> you. 
smash the car. Then you can't even... What is this shit? valves plus the primary gate. Uh-huh. What about the ballast lines? Wait, the, the what? Flaming flatulence. Do I have to tell you everything? Obviously, you have to close all the valves on the blue line to keep the pressure balanced. Now hurry up. We're going to be leaking more gas than Grandma Christmas. No! They do <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Commander. This ain't the Navy, son. Drink some coffee and sober up. Done, soldier. I'll open the main pressure gate. Then prepare your eyes for a feast of controlled pyro combustion. Now, I think I should watch this from a distance. If you insist, you got ten seconds. Jeff, and the gas is back on. That's a relief. I told you, he's irreplaceable. Yeah, well, I'm afraid you're gonna have to find a replacement. Copy. Brecken, do you copy? Shit. Jade, this is Crane. Do you copy? Crane, how much antisense did you get? Listen, Rice wanted me to... He's... Look, he screwed us, okay? I only got five vials. What? Damn it! That's only a few days' worth. Listen, Crane. We've got a situation here. There's been an outbreak on the 18th floor. Get back here ASAP, and don't lose any of that antisense. Jade just told me there's been an outbreak on the 18th floor. I've got to get what little antis and I have back to the tower pronto. Do you have the antis in? Give it to me. So what happened? One person turned and had a couple of other people trapped. We could have sealed off that one apartment, but Brecken wanted to save as many lives as possible. It went bad. Somebody had to make the call, and now we've lost the entire floor, including... including a couple of kids. You'd better talk to Brecken. I have to get these meds to Lina. This is where we get the announcements about the antisyndrops. 
and they just stopped. They were cases. Lena had to step up. Maybe she should be in charge. What the fuck, Crane? I'm no leader. I'm a goddamn parkour instructor. Wait, so all the free running. Wait, that was you? Brecken, you showed these people how to survive. Do you know what my pockets were full of when I showed up in Haran? Fucking business cards. I was hoping to drum up some more students. Maybe get enough so I could save up and buy a house. Instead of that poxy little flat I've been renting. Listen. I'm gonna talk to Rice myself. Whoa, whoa, H hang on a minute. Reckon these people still need you. Okay, just, just give me some time, all right? There's, there's gotta be another way, a better way. Fine, I'll wait, but not for long. Finally, I get to do some actual good.